Alright, and back from our quest, and today we're going to be playing Epic Vladis. I you say that by Fumbly Bumbly again, and we only have one more map after that from Fumbly, so let's get into it. Fun little fact for you, I was counting the amount of maps I have left. For human oh, here we go again, again guys. An old Always talking over box. me. The number one request, less deadly tests. So anyways, as I was saying. That's ridiculous. How do they know for sure the tests are deadly if they could still write the suggestion? Are you done? So as I was saying, a little Easter egg for you. Um, I counted the amount of maps I have left, so the amount of episodes I can make with them, and it rounds out to exactly 400. So that's uh, that's actually pretty nice, because I might, I might end it at 400. Just let you know that. But what are we doing here? Okay, so we need the laser to leave. I'm assuming it involves this light bridge turning it on and off as we go. So yeah, I can go down there, step on the button, and that's going to flip the panel, or angle that up, so I have to use that surface instead. Possibly. Let's see. Because if it does that, I mean, I don't know how it's going to do much for me, because I'm from a different angle here, so... But let's just land here, and go over see what else we can do, because I'm sure we have to go farther over and then work our way back. What is all this? I don't want to jump off there, just in case I can't get back yet. Well, obviously I would be able to, because, you know. But, I just meant for getting the cube purposes. Oh, there's another cube over there as well. That is a regular cube. Alright. Probably some sort of swapping going to be going on later, so. Let's take this back. Set this... Or I can go this way. That looks kind of high up, though. Although there is a little, whatever little surface thing there is over there. <laughs> I swear my vocabulary is good, I promise. Okay, is there a surface I can jump down on? No. Something tells me I should have just stuck with my original plan. Also that. So I guess I have to jump off of that to land up over there at some point. Yeah, let's just stick to my original idea of going back to the beginning with the button, setting this on that button. Because I don't think I can make much progress yet. Oh, that's right. I thought the fizzler was a, was a little bit further back. Oh, I set this here. Put it on this button instead, because that lifts up a panel. Once I center it, just want to make sure I get it on there. Yes, that is that is not what I wanted. I will fix that right now. I am sorry. <laughs> okay, have it on here properly this time. So let's go back. Step on this button so it stops the light bridge from going across. So that also shuts off our fizzler. Now let me land up here and see what we can work with now. Is there a white surface down in there? No. See, I also can't... I can't get in there yet, so there's something that tells me I need to have something else on that button as well. I was thinking, if I, if I do that... See, if I jump down... No. I could redrop it here, but then I don't have a surface. Well, I could take it this way and drop down into that, and then I'd be over there with this cube. But how would that help me? I mean, it would be on this side, and then I could put it onto that. You know, I felt like I almost had it there with my plan. The only problem is, is once I bring the cube in on that side... I would have to then do an extra portal to get it back through here to set it on this button to lift this panel up. So I'd have to go back through and then I put the blue portal on that and then I just have it inside here with this fizzler up and I can't do anything. So, and even if I did somehow get that all set up, I would have the problem, I'm going to fly to show the example, 
I would have to then get up out of here with just a light bridge, and that's not possible unless I also portal on this ceiling, so... Either way, I'm kind of screwed on that plan, so that's really not going to work for me. No matter how hard I wanted to, because I really thought I was making progress. I'm just going to do this, because I, I, I don't know. And by this, I mean go through here with my blue portal. And just set it on the button over there and see what I can make out of it, because I've been stuck, and uh, I've made zero progress. Okay, so if we set this here. I have my blue portal in there. Like I said I would, but I'd be stuck. Oh. Hey, that would have been, you know, been nice. If whenever I did that, I had the orange portal up there instead. Shit. You know what, actually... Let me go back through here. I know I just kind of cut myself off from the other area, but now since that uh, light bridge is in there, I might be able to just drop down myself onto that button and hit the uh, other side. I didn't even think of that till right now. Yes, okay, there we go. So if we do this, and then, yes, go down here through this way. I can then do this, go through, go all the way around to uh, this white surface on this wall, and go across. Finally, we made some progress. Alright, so up here. I have no idea what's even over here. We have our laser. Which I need to get a laser cube and angle over there. Shit, I should have grabbed that. Oh wait, no, I can't do that. Because it wouldn't even work. I was... Dumb me to even say. Can I at least get it across? No. Because I need that laser connection regardless, so. This seems like something that would be useful for later on. So if I go through to here, we're on this side. Doesn't help me at all. At the moment. That I know of. But that's probably the end move to leave. Because you'd come out with the laser. Or with the light bridge. Switch it over to the laser somehow. I don't know how that's going to work. I feel like I've barely scratched the surface of this map. And I've been here for like 20 minutes. Like I said earlier. We know that we need to jump off of this. To get up above. I'm going to fly over again just to show. To get up above here. Without needing to multiple portal around. So, I know we have that. So if I was to go through here, because, I mean, I can only go this way. I, I There's no other way I can go besides inside this room without screwing myself portal-wise. Oh. Well, I guess I could jump over that, too. <laughs> that could work. Just don't fall off? Okay. Yeah, because if I jump over that... Let me let me think about this before I actually do it. If I jump over this, why else would this be here? It would just be fully graded. Jump over that. Go grab that. Go through with the uh, orange portal. Line up the laser. Wouldn't have my light bridge. So there's that missing. But we'll come to that whenever we uh, need to. Looks like we made some progress. Alright, so orange portal here. Take this off. Yeah, see now I can do... I can do this, right? A blue portal here. Possibly go back. I possibly go back this way. I don't think I can see the surface, though, from the ground. You know what? I think I was overcomplicating it. I'm going to go back, because I think I might I might know how to get over there now. I'm going to orange portal here. 
we're gonna go through. Don't, don't die. Just move this like away for a second, and uh, we're gonna jump through, land, go back through. While we're standing here, we line that up and go back through from the ground. Get the cube. Okay, we're good. We're good. Yeah, so if I do this, and then I do this, we just jump through, do that, do that, there's our cube, take it through this way, and then possibly just repeat all the steps, but with this cube that we did in the beginning, maybe. Or we're just gonna go this way, because I can almost guarantee in some in some way I need this cube to do what the other cube did in the beginning. See, because if I if I lay it here then I can't um I won't be able to redrop it to get it back. So do I actually redrop the other cube, redo most of the puzzle now with two cubes instead? Then I'm able to leave? Because if I have a cube here... And a cube here... At the same time... Then I would be able to portal up there? When I'm inside here? And get the light bridge going again? I think? I'm not quite sure. I'm scared to try it, so give me some time to think. I have decided to redrop this, and let's hope that this is the way to go because we're going to be putting this cube exactly where we put it the first time, which is on this button. And then we're going to put this cube on the other button over here once I go and step on this. Because if everything works out like it did last time, we should be able to get back and forth. So let's drop down here. Let's take this over. I can drop down over there and get across as well. There we go, which I should help getting to the end fairly easy. I think I'm almost done, actually. Let's drop down there. Let's go across here. Yeah, I think I am done, because now I get across this way. Okay, so we'll just speed that up. And then if I do this. Oh wait, I'm not done yet. That shit, that's right. The, the laser needs to be angled. Don't I just take that with me then? Yeah, I would just take that with me. I can just go back and grab that. Alright, got the cube. Totally didn't fly and grab it. And we're gonna go and uh, go across now. And set this up. And go through it. And we should be done. Very good map. These are always challenging. Not annoyingly challenging, though. I mean, a good type of challenging. I'm gonna do this just to get across, so I don't kill myself. And now we'll do this. So then we got this, and then we just do blue here. Blue here. And we are done. So once again, I'm gonna give you an 8.5 on that. Consistently challenging throughout all your maps. Consistently great, with a consistent score. Never too hard to be frustrating, though. It's always hard enough where you know you can get the solution if you just sit there and think long enough and walk around and get the get a feel for the map. So with that, I'm done for today. See you next time where we finish our last map. Unless you have more to send me, feel free to send me more. I don't mind. But done for today. See you next time.